You can insert predefined symbols such as north arrows and trees using the symbol librarian and it can be found under the MS Annotate ribbon menu. When you open it up you can see there's a list of folders containing various symbols. We've got north arrows, trees, symbols for posts, and you also see you have some options at the bottom. If I wanted to insert a north arrow, I can highlight it, choose insert, I can then set the rotation by clicking my mouse or if I press enter I'll get the default rotation of zero degrees or east. You can also apply a scale override, so I can turn that option on and set that to 2. And if we insert the symbol again, we can see we've doubled up the scale. Once I've selected a symbol out of one of the folders, I can add it to my favorites menu, choose add current, then we can see North 1 has been added to my favorites. You can review more detailed info from each symbol by choosing Selection Info. Again, I could remove that North arrow from my favorites. Tile Left will allow me to view my drawing and the symbol librarian side by side as two separate windows rather than the symbol librarian lim window overlapping. I can search for example, tree. You can see 84 results were found. If I go up to my search results folder, we can see various tree symbols are displayed. Once I've selected a symbol, I can duplicate it, giving it another name. I could edit a symbol which will open up the drawing file where it's stored if I need to make some changes or I can delete it as well. You can add new symbols by choosing add symbol and this will open up a blank drawing in which you could create your own custom. And I can also import existing drawing files as symbols if I've already created them. Again, you can see there are many different symbols to choose from for all sorts of things that you may want inserted into your drawing. And you can also create your own if need be.